What's going on everybody? Today we are actually going to be opening up some Scarlet and Violet building battle boxes. I'm not going to lie to you, I really thought these were the booster bundles. So today we got kind of a fun surprise for both of us because I just realized that these were not the booster bundles and their building battle, which if you don't know, contains 40 cards, or a 40 card deck actually, and four packs of Pokemon cards instead, well, of Scarlet and Violet, obviously it's Pokemon cards, but we're going to take a quick look through the decks. Um, I don't really play it, but we're about to find out what it's like. And then we also, wow, that knife didn't work, but we're also going to, Jesus, this stuff is thick, but we're also going to open two other packs. Sorry, I said that like three times, but yeah, we got two other packs of Scarlet and Violet to make it exactly 10. And let's see. Oh, I love this artwork. I'm eventually going to buy one of these and just keep it in a blister and, um, oh, that's pretty cool. It's even got the little scarlet and violet thing. I might keep these sealed. I'm going to keep these sealed. We're not going to go through these. I'm just going to keep these sealed for now. Um, maybe if we get all, actually, what is this? Before we threw it away. Oh. Maybe I'll start learning to play. Alright. I'm going to keep one of these. Screw it. I'm going to set this off to the side. Um, maybe, maybe I'll learn how to play with these decks. And then as I my kids get older, we can play with those together. Let's see if we got the same guy in here. Uh, what one was that? That was... Uh, we'll get it back up here in a second. Once we get this one open, we'll check it out again. Bunch of bull crap. All right. Four packs. <laughs> that time we doubled up on Karyodon, which is sweet, because that was the one I picked. I got Scarlet. I don't know what you guys got. Ooh. Oh, shit. Now I'm going to have to buy more of these. I'm not kidding, because I'm guessing... Since this is one of them, I bet the other two starters are one too, and this is just kind of the outlier since there's four of them, the Palmot. But, yeah, I would really like to actually learn how to battle. I'm going to have to get the... I got to have the Skeldra's one just for myself, because that was what I picked. So, let's get right into some pack openings. We got ten packs, which I think we only have one Gyarados. I don't know if we've seen another one. Is there one down here? No, we... Oh, no, we did. We got two. Okay. So, that's what we got. Let's see if Scarlet and Violet can get on my good side. I only, I really had to look deep into this set because I didn't know a lot about it, to be honest, because I wasn't that big of a fan. And now, after looking over the set list, because I do have, well, let's just get into it. Nothing there. Let's see what else we hit. Oh, Fue Coco. Woo! Um, nothing really good. I always forget this one doesn't have the pack trick, so let's hope that doesn't continue. But anyways, back to what I was saying. <clears throat> Scarlet and Violet, for me, I'm not a fan of the Terra cards at all. So all the EXs, even the Gyarados, I'm not a fan of. Uh, I don't know. I just don't like the little crystal things they put up. I did it again! I don't like the little crystal things they put on their heads. Skelly Dridge. I'll take that one. That one looks actually pretty decent. And... Sprigigato. Nothing really good, but... Hopefully that trend does not continue. I'm sorry, but... Let's see. There's only a couple of cards here. Sorry, I'm getting lost because I keep fucking up the pack trick, but... I know I want the Riolu. That was one that I knew about right away. There's, um... I think it's Sandlet or something like that. That's like buried in the sand. That's kind of cool. And then, of course, what's the other one? There was one I seen recently that I didn't even know existed in there. And, yeah, it's pretty sick, too. What the hell is it? We're just going to keep doing this until I figure out what the hell I'm saying and get these cards out of my mind. I'm just going to keep screwing it up. I think I already have this. The EXs are kind of cool. I do like the way they make them kind of pop out, but eh, I'm still not that into it. But there's Riolu, 
Is there a great tusk? I think that's just an EX. I think it might be iron treads. That's pretty cool. And ah, there was one that I just, oh, the drowsy. Yeah, that one's super sick. I really like the drowsy. I thought that was going to be in Paldea Evolved for some reason. Don't do the pack trick, stupid. But I thought it was going to be in Paldea Evolved for some reason. And when I realized it was in this set, I was like, shit, I've been kind of missing out. I haven't been opening a lot of this because, again, I'm not the biggest fan. And you can see why. Basic energy. Because they're just... They're just terribly cut, one, and two, I don't know, there, there wasn't a lot. The crystal cards, I don't like, Terra, whatever you want to call them, I'm not a fan of those. There wasn't, and, I mean, obviously the starters were hollows, but like, all day of all, I'm super stoked because I can't wait to chase the Skelly Dridge and the Fue Coco and Croconaw. I think, damn it, I did it again. <laughs> Well, this is going to be a short video because we're not going to get anything. Yeah, but that set I'm going to be super excited for. I was debating on doing a live stream this week, so maybe next week we'll do a live stream opening up a booster box. If that's something you guys want to see, make sure you drop a comment if you made it this far. I know it's kind of been a wild video, but it happens. Got to do the best you can with what you got to work with, right? Almost did it again. Did you see that? All right. Wiglet. Is that like, is that Grievard? That's how I say it. Uh, Sandaconda. He was, he's pretty cool. I do like the Sandaconda V. I don't remember what set it's from. Wait, Coco, yes! I'm actually, oh, I like this character too. I really liked fighting him as a boss. It's pretty sweet like that too. I don't know. I, I do kind of keep some hollows. Just because I like them. I think I'll add that one to the one I like. This reverse though. Obviously it's a starter base. I don't think it's ever going to have a hollow. Or if they ever have. But I'm going to keep that reverse. Because. Boy Coco. And Totodile. Oh hit the camera. Those are two of my favorite Pokemon at this point. I really like. I really thought it was kind of cool. Because I just literally got back into Pokemon. Like. I would say end of last year when Arceus came out, and then, yeah, the next one, Scarlet and Violet, gives me basically the same thing. We're down to four packs. We're obviously going to save the starters for last, because that's just how I like to do it. Save the favorite art from me last. Pariodon, I actually have the Scarlet and Violet promo at Beckett right now, whenever that decides to get graded. I did it again. It's just never going to stop. Whenever they decide to... Man. Scarlet and Violet hates me too. Obviously. But I don't know when that's going to be back from grading. But I got a bunch of cards there. I think 14. It was either 14 or 15. I know I sent a lot out. Because I was like, I don't know which ones to choose. So I'm just going to send all of them. I sent that out with a bunch of alligators And a Mewtwo V-Star... Some other stuff I can't even remember at this point. <sighs> I mean, it is kind of cool if you do the back trick and you just get the last three cards. Gardevoir EX. Okay. Again, go EXs, whatever. They're cool, but none of them are ones I want. Like, it, I don't know. Does this one have a Skelly Dridge? Or any of them? I think that's the next set, too. But anyways, we're getting close to the last pack. It's only about a 10 minute video, so I hope you guys actually watch to the end. If you did, make sure you drop a comment. Let me know what I can do better because I just got this new setup. Except for not messing up the damn pack trick. <sighs> Karayadon out of Karayadon, though. We'll take that, I guess. Man, what the hell is going on? All right, we're going to get some last pack magic because if not... These building battle kits suck. But I do. I'm not kidding. I'm going to get a couple more. We might not. You might not see them on the channel. You might see the packs. But I do want the other two. We'll see if I can get them buying two more. Because they're not that expensive. They're only. Where I got them, they're only 20 bucks a piece. So that should have been an alarm right there. Knowing that they're usually more expensive than that. But I was in a hurry. 
my wife and kids were in the car. I literally just went into the game shop to buy some crap. And I just started naming off stuff I wanted. Well, let's see what we got. I hope you guys have a great night. Maybe we'll get a big hit. And we don't. We double up. There's the... Oh, I guess it evolved. Whatever. Make sure you subscribe if you like the video. We'll be doing more content. If there's something you want to see, make sure you drop that in the comments too. Because like I said, I'm thinking about doing a live for Paul Day Evolved. And if you guys would watch it, I will do it. I'll buy a whole booster box. We'll just sit here, talk, chat, screw around, and... See what we can get out of Paul Day Evolved. You guys have a great day. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.